We're off to one of the world's most beautiful places, stunning islands, here and out of the world, joining our epic world tour. Before starting, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more future updates. So, let's start. World of the Caribbean, starting in Martinique, took the boat to this little slice of heaven. Because this is Saint Lucia but Martinique was certainly no punishment either in the last episode. You saw this beautiful part of France the first place. We are staying here at Saint Lucia's is a really special one because the S is Crystal Villa's hotel, where you sleep in three houses in the middle of the jungle. Especially the view of St. Lucia's crown jewels is amazing those peaks over there are the pistons. We're staying at Crystal's Villa Hotel in Silver Palm, which has an amazing view. This luxury villa with a swimming pool is truly a highlight in itself. We didn't expect this in such a remote place in the middle of the jungle, but we want to see a lot more of St. Lucia, so we rented this blue little monster at Drive a Medic. Today we visit the most beautiful spot in the Soufier area, the Diamond Botanical Gardens, where you can walk on nature trail towards the Diamond Waterfall in the middle of the tropical rainforest. Hummingbirds and mineral-rich grey water make a great spa. That's one of the benefits of having a kitchen. I'm cooking rice, vegetables, and chicken from the oven today. We're going to one of the most beautiful beaches on St. Lucia, Ansa Shastanet, which is great for snorkeling. Let's grab some gear and go. The local bar in Souffle is called Whispers, and it's our regular spot even though it turns into a disco at night. The Pittons are St. Lucia's main attraction, and Ted Paul Nature Trail offers the best views of them. Let's go okay Kansas their way to heaven in total the hike takes us an hour there and back and it's a must do of course we couldn't possibly skip the most beautiful beach between the two pittons and it's called Jealousy Plantation Beach or Suga Beach with one of the two pittons on every side so now we see the view that we had at Ted Paul from up close it's so relaxed and insanely beautiful when you drive around St. Lucia you'll notice that every site is different.